Yo, what up, fam? It's Phantom. In today's video, we are playing Pokemon Radical Red. I'm super excited to jump into this because I think it's supposed to be just like a remake of Fire Red and Leaf Green, but it's going to be a lot harder with a lot more Pokemon, a lot more things to do. So I'm really excited to try this one out. I know a lot of people have been asking me to play this game. It is a really, really like, uh, w like played game. A lot of people play this ROM. So I'm really excited to see what it's like. So let's just jump in. Let's do the normal real quick stuff. We'll cut to when we get past all this. Do you want to simply play Radical Red without any custom options? No. What are the custom options? Minimal grinding mode guarantees all Pokemon to have perfect IVs. EVs cannot be obtained. Likewise, boss Pokemon will not have EVs either. This is for people who dislike EV training or grinding for perfect IVs. Do you want to turn minimal grinding mode on? Let's turn that on. That sounds like it'd be a lot more exciting that way. Uh, hardcore mode makes this game even more difficult as it is. Tricks certain abilities and play moves players and bosses make it more powerful. And they pair with mental grind to make it less tedious. It isn't advised to attempt this on your first playthrough. I don't want that. I'm not trying to make this terribly hard on myself. Restricted mode restricts certain abilities and moves from the player. No. Easy mode removes EVs on boss Pokemon and reduces their levels slightly. Switch mode can be used and items are allowed in boss battles. It's definitely less difficult. Okay, I want it to be as difficult as it's supposed to be. Randomizer, obviously, I don't want randomizer on. Do you want to turn the ability randomizer? No. Do you want to le learn set randomizer? You are in the game. You're only weak Pokemon when you start, and then begin scaling when you see more gym battles. Do you want to turn on scaled randomizer? No. That's kind of cool. There's a lot of different options you can have if you want to build this as a as a randomizer, and it's not just like, oh, I got a legendary Pokemon at the beginning. Like It scales as you play. That's really, really cool. Which region your starter was from? Whoa, can you choose which region? Yes. Oh my god, that's it has all the way up to Galar. I have to choose a Galar. I feel like seeing a Galar Pokemon in a GBA ROM hack is just going to be really trippy. So I feel like I got to try Galar. Let's go ahead and get to finding our Pokemon. Let's see what they look like in the game. I'm excited to see these because that's, that's really cool. Okay, I'm not trying to go away. Sorry, I clicked too quick. Sobble. Look at Sobble. Oh my gosh. Grookey, Grookey's adorable, and Score Bunny. I don't like Score Bunny, the look of it. I'm gonna go with Sobble. I definitely think Sobble is my favorite of the three starters in Gen 8. Do you want to give nickname to Sobble? No, I don't really nickname my Pokemon ever. All right, let's go ahead and let's go fight Gary. Here we go. All right, so it's it's pretty self-explanatory. Oh, I almost died there, but I didn't. We good. Sobble grew to level six and learned Aqua Jet. I love to see it. All right, this is pretty cool. So this seems like it's going to be pretty standard, run-of-the-mill Pokemon Fire Red. So let's just go and see what kind of changes we're running into. Obviously, we have custom starters, so that's really cool. We set on the trainer tips. Trainer tips. Blah, blah, blah. Whatever. Okay, Zigzagoon. So yeah, the wild Pokemon are already changed, which is interesting. It is nice that we don't have to worry about EVs or anything, so we can kind of get what we want to get, or battle who we want to battle. It's just about levels at this point, so that we don't have to worry about EVs, which is nice. There's Pidgey, which is originally in this route. I don't know if level 5 Pidgeys are normally in the route. Probably. Oh, Panseer. Wow. There's some. There's a lot of different Pokemon on Route 1. Young Goose. Already a good amount of different Pokemon on this route. So, Mindfu. Wow, there's some really cool Pokemon to choose from. I don't know... Who I'm going to choose? I'm definitely not going to choose Zigzagoon. But there are some really cool ones. Also, even that Rattata's, um, even the Rattata, the way that looks is different than it is in Fire Red and Leaf Green. So it looks like they probably messed with all the different Pokemon sprites because it's definitely different than what it normally is. That Rattata is not what it normally looks like. Oh, they have following Pokemon? <gasps> yes! Look at little Sobble. Oh my god, that's amazing. Also, why is there two nurses? Nature change level cap gender swap mod info. Wow. You can do a lot in this. This is crazy. All right. Let's see what's in route. Whatever route this is. I can't remember what route this is. A lily pup. Okay. Yankee's normally on this route. So there's a Pokemon that's usually on this route. There's some different Pokemon. More lulls. Not what I want to fight, though. We should probably get to the point where we can get... Pokeballs. Let's go do that first before we start getting too into this. Whoa! Wait a minute. There is grass in Viridian City. That's really weird. What Pokemon is are in here? Oh, Sandshrew. Okay, it's an early Sandshrew. A Shinx. This is really trippy. A Wingle. I wonder if they put this in here to just make training easier, so you can just kind of. Go to the, 
go to the Pokemon Center right after? I don't know. That's that's really interesting. It's very different. I like also playing ROM hacks that are like remakes of games because I know exactly where to go and what to do. And like custom regions. I like custom regions. They're really cool. But like having some familiarity with these ROM hacks makes it really nice because I've played Fire Red and Leaf Green probably hundreds of times. Uh, and a, a Gen 1 in general, I've played so many times through all the different remakes and stuff. So uh, it's been, it's been, it, Kanto is a, is a region that I know fondly. Let's catch this Sandow. This would be a cool Pokemon to have. I feel like we don't normally... I don't normally play with a Sandile, so... This would be a cool Pokemon added to the team. All right. Sobble's level 12 learns U-Turn. Wow, I didn't know it could learn U-Turn. A Snubble. Okay. Gramble would be kind of a cool Pokemon, but I don't think we're going to use that either. I'm, I think I'm just going to stick with Sandile for now on the team, and we'll see what kind of Pokemon we can get. I'm curious what we're going to find in the Viridian Forest. Almost didn't recognize you. I'm one of Oak's aides. I was just picking up a package for the press. I think he wanted to give you this, but didn't have time. Dexnav. Wow. Give me a berry. Okay. So they give me the Dexnav, which is different. Oh, why you... Okay. I don't know exactly. I'm, I'm assuming the Dexnav works like it does in the... In Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire, but I don't know for sure. Wow. An Abra already. The Abra's sprite is massive. Also, it definitely hit me with something, so it doesn't it doesn't just have teleport like it normally does. Fampy! Oh my god, Fampy's adorable. Whoa! Viridian Forest is different. What? This map is different, because that's normally you can go up and go north from here. So it's really weird that it doesn't have the map like it normally is. Whoa! That's like Brandon from uh Gen 3. Joltik somewhere. Oh, hello. I'm just trying to catch some Pokemon before I go to challenge Brock. Oh, you're looking to challenge him as well? Why don't you have a battle then? Wow, we're battling Brandon. Or usually what his name is, Brandon. I don't know if it's... Yep, Brendan. Sorry, excuse me. Brendan. All right, we're fighting Corpfish. Not the best matchup for us, but I think we can take him out. All day. And then Trico. This should be an easy dub for Sandile. Oh, wow. Okay, he gave us the XP share. Stat scanner. What is... I'm heading over the... What is a stat scanner? I don't know what that is. Okay, so the XP share in this game is also for all of your Pokemon. It's like the newer game. So I, I am going to go ahead and use this. Oh, wait. No, I turned off. Okay, so it automatically is turned on after that point. So that's good to know. And then what is the stat scanner? The special device can analyze EVs and IVs of a Pokemon in your party. It doesn't matter because my Pokemon already have max EVs and IVs. So that's nice to not have to worry about. So now we have our sand dial level 12. Oh my god, this Audino is so annoying. Thank god. God damn. Wow. You can have an infinite repel. That is so... They just take grinding completely out of this game. That's actually really cool. That's just like... I'm not, I don't know if I've seen another... I don't know if I've seen another ROM hack with that. That's really interesting. That's very different. All right, let me go heal. I need to heal desperately. Ooh, Houndour. That's kind of cool. Will I kill it with a bite? I shouldn't. Okay. Let me catch this Houndour. That's actually a cool teammate. And, of course, this is like the mascot of Radical Red is Houndoom, which is right above me. So that's kind of cool. I feel like I got to catch this. There it is. Houndour's caught. Let's see how quickly I can level up Houndour to the rest of our levels and see if we can use him in this next gym battle. Not that we will, because Sobble should just sweep this gym, but I don't know. I could be wrong. Oh, wow, it's Faulkner. I'm traveling to Kanto looking for a mega evolution. Nothing so far. Battle is what you're looking for. I guess I could spare the time. I'll demonstrate the power of the elegant. Wow, you have to fight Faulkner. That's interesting. Okay. Wow, and they are not a joke. Oh, my God. That is actually annoying. Okay. Holy cow! Jesus! I don't think I'm going to be able to beat this thing. Unless I get super lucky. Nope, I just lost. Holy cow! Alright, first loss of Radical Red. That's so annoying. Holy cow. If 
Finally. Okay. And of course it killed me because its attack is insane. Do you have quick attack or something? You don't. You're going to die. I, I can't beat this mother. Oh my god, that's so annoying. Okay. I guess we're raising Pikachu up too. Holy cow, this is crazy. Okay, I got Moxie there. And that's huge. But he keeps roosting. And I never get a crit. Like, where are my crits? It just uh, Does this move just not crit? Like, where are my crits? Not once. Oh! It doesn't matter because he's too freaking fast! Oh my god! Oh, it worked. It worked. Not that it's going to matter because this Amolga is just going to poop on me. And, of course, they didn't get the confused. Oh, we were close. We were, we were closer. We're closer. We are closer. We I think we need a fifth freaking Pokemon. We can do this, guys. We can do this. I got to get his roosts out. I got to get his roosts out. That's perfect. That's perfect. Get his roosts out with, with Houndour. This is working out well. Oh, we did it. We did it. We finally did it. Oh, my God. Just That was just the first gym. Could you imagine? Could you imagine? I don't think you could. Could you even beat this game as a Nuzlocke? Like, this is insane. I got Roost, you stupid son of a gun. He gave me Roost. That's just, if that's not a smack in the face, I don't know what it is. All right, here we go. Going against Brock. Let's see how this goes. I'm a little scared. I'm a little afraid, but we'll see how this goes. Four Pokemon. Okay, he starts with Geodude. I start with Geodude. Go out the rollout. I feel like that's got to be the move. Holy cow, why do you know rollout or bulldoze? Man. All right. Hopefully, I can outspeed him. I can. Okay, perfect. Onyx. Hopefully, I can outspeed him. Yes, I can. That's fine. How are you outspeeding me after one speed slow? Okay, that's fine. Okay, we take it out. Last one, Arkin. I feel like... Here we switch to Pikachu because he's not going to do us any good. We kind of quick attack it out. We go into Hound Out. We just we just really want to make sure we set up for Sobble if we have to. What am I doing? Why am I trying to use a ground attack on a flying type Pokemon? Okay, okay. Now Sobble with Aqua Jet should take this out. Let's go. Let's go. First try taking out Brock. My goodness. This game is not easy. This game is difficult. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.